Hey guys, um, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we're going to be installing some uh, Boost Auto Parts 99-02 mirrors. Um, I optioned these mirrors out. Uh, they have the smoked lenses with the dots, but I have other clear lens with the chrome and the strips that I'm going to do. be doing some custom lighting in, so I'll show you guys that in the next video most likely. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna be changing that out on here. Full paint match and all that. That'll all be in the next video. This video, I'm just gonna do a review and show you guys how to install them. Um, so these mirrors are the 2015 to 2019. I think that's when they switched over body styles, but this is that uh, those years style toe mirrors. And um, the only thing that's really different is they change out these bases. So they got, Boost Auto has uh, 88 to 98, 99 to 06 or 07 and a half, uh, the 07 and a half to 2013 or 2014. Um, and they even got it for the actual truck that's supposed to have the style tow mirror. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go through today and show you how to install these, wire them up. So right now I have um, some Amazon mirrors, you know, the cheap ones. And they're okay, you know, they, they've they worked for the past couple of years. I've had them taken apart, paint matched multiple times. Uh, you know, the chrome is peeling on them. They're just kind of junky. Um, and on these Amazon mirrors, uh, the lower, glass uh you can't remove it without breaking the glass because where the glass mounts onto uh, the plastic piece the screws behind the glass so you just got to break it off um, but boost auto sells a, a kit to where you can um add the add it so it just pops off like these top ones so yeah i mean that that's the disadvantage of these mirrors and um you know Stuff just isn't right with them, and they're just really cheap. So that's why I'm getting rid of them, and we're going to uh, be paint matching these in the next video. I'm going to show you guys how to take them apart and um, sand it all down and paint match them. All right, guys, so to get started, you're going to want to take off your uh, door panel, but my truck's been taken apart for months, and... Um, I don't have the door panels on right now, but it's really easy. Anybody can really do it. Uh, so you're gonna have a plastic piece right here. You're gonna pop that off. It's just little clips that can pop into here. It'll come right off. And you'll have a piece of foam here. Pull that out. Uh, your plug will be in here if you have power mirrors. If you don't, you won't have a plug or anything. Um, this is the wiring for the cheap Amazon mirrors. Uh, so you're gonna have these three 10 mil bolts. Take those out and your mirror comes right off. Um, but yeah, for the door panel, uh, you're gonna have a screw. It's over here, it might be this one. Yeah, I think it's this one, right where you close your door, you know, the handle. And then you got one down here, or it's over there actually. Um, so once you do that, you pull it up, comes right off, really easy. Um, so for the wiring, you know, I don't have a, uh, power dash, so I don't have power windows or locks. That's why I bought a new dash that has power windows and locks. We're going to swap it in here. All so, right. So we're going to start by, um, taking out these bolts. Then it pops right out of there, you know, easy peasy. Um, so yeah, I mean like these mirrors are just not good anymore. I didn't want to use them, especially for, especially for how much I have into this truck. I needed to get some high quality tow mirrors on this. Thing. So I already have um, running light and turn signal running up into the door here. 
and ground i'm just grounding off the door but i'm gonna change that i did that a few months ago real quick because i was just trying to get the truck back on the road after restoring it um but yeah so the boost auto is gonna want you to run those wires down through here through this rubber piece right here into the cab and then your bcm right under here um you're gonna splice into the wires on one of the plugs they have a whole video explaining how to do that um but yeah you're gonna splice in these fuses and then plug it right in i mean it's very very simple to install these um and they just give you good instructions unlike the amazon ones uh there's no instructions at all really and, and if you don't know what you're doing it's going to be difficult but uh this is a pretty easy process all right um so the easiest way to do this is roll down your window and uh, just grab your wiring put it through the hole and line up your bolt holes push it through and then grab your nuts and put them on the mirrors all right so we got the mirrors on the truck um most people they'll pop off this piece right here and uh, add washers on the top to uh, level out the tow mirror so they don't have a you know they don't lean and make them flat but i kind of like it like this so i'm probably not going to do that but yeah i mean it's that easy to throw the mirror on there so if you didn't want to have any of these lights or anything you just wanted the mirrors uh that's all you gotta do just blow it up but we're gonna have to rig up some stuff for now until i get my dash swapped in here so i have power mirrors and all that so i got a plug right here with turn running light and ground uh so we're just going to take the harness that uh, boost auto gives us and we're going to splice in to my wires for now and all right uh so we got it rigged up here your blue wire is your turn your white is your reverse light and then obviously black is ground um so yeah i got it flashing right now you see you you got the turn in the mirror, which that's optional. You don't have to get that. Um, and the uh, reverse lights, which you would have, tap those into your reverse light wire, but I just have it in the running light right now because um, that's just what I have here because I still have to, I'm pulling the whole dash out, so I don't want to run any new wires in right now. Um, and then you got obviously got the turn up here, and you could also have this as just a running light as well so yeah that's what it looks like um turning and they have a lot of different options for here they got sequential switchback switchback um you know in the strip form and then they got the dots um smoked and clear so yeah let me switch this over to uh the running lights so you can see what that All looks right, so like. we just got it on the running light wire right now and uh that's what it looks like you know you have a bunch of different options if you don't like this um you can get a different option i'm just switching it out because i'm gonna be building some custom lights with a animated startup to go in there i'm pretty sure boost auto also sells those lights too with a uh startup animation so yeah all right so um yeah that's really how you install them I uh, definitely recommend checking out Boost Auto Parts. Um, quality mirrors. They're worth every penny compared to the Amazon ones. The Amazon ones just do not compare to these. You know, you're not going to have chrome peeling off your caps or water up in these lights. The wiring's easy. They have great customer service if you need help. And, uh, yeah. So check out the next video, and we're going to be tearing these mirrors down. Um, I'll show you how to build some custom lights, how to open these up and wire everything. And then, um, yeah, paint match them and throw them back on the truck. 
So yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Bye. I'm going to leave a uh, link below for Boost Auto's website and um, a link to their YouTube video on how to install these mirrors. Um, I highly recommend checking that video out. It's definitely going to help you.